Yo guys, what is good? It's your boy John Wong here, back again with another video. And if you haven't checked out my previous video, make sure you go ahead and do that afterwards. But today, we are going over the top 5 sneaker and style tips that you can do during quarantine. During this time, I know a lot of you guys are forced to stay home, which means for your sneaker lovers, you can't show off those new kicks that you just got in the mail. And yeah, I know that sucks. But you know what? I have five tips that can get you through this quarantine. So if that sounds interesting to you, let's hop into it. So the first thing you want to do on this list is to clean your sneakers. I understand a lot of you guys before quarantine started really didn't have any time to clean your sneakers or probably never thought about it. But guys, like I said before, this is the perfect time to do it. Personally for me, cleaning sneakers is a hobby. I've used Jason Marks and Rejuvenator, but you guys could also use other brands such as Crep Protect and other off-name brands as well. For me, I'm always cleaning my shoes, such as my stands right here. I'm always making sure that they're white and they look new, and just trying my best to really make them look presentable. This is ultimately going to help you when quarantine is over, because the minute you step out of the house, you're going to have a fresh pair of kicks to wear. So number one on this list, clean those dirty sneakers, guys. The second thing that you can do during this quarantine is clean out your closet. Now I know a lot of you guys probably have a lot of unwanted and unworn things sitting around that you probably will never ever wear again. Instead, you can either one, sell your clothes, or two, donate them to charity for a better cause. Personally for me, I sell my clothes off of Poshmark and eBay as I see it more of a double win. I'm making money back and at the same time, I'm also creating more closet space for the future. This is ultimately making your closet much more stylish as you're getting rid of unwanted things and making more room for when you buy more clothes in the future. But if you don't sell your clothes, I really suggest that you donate your pieces to thrift stores or to other people who are not as fortunate to be able to have clothes as well. So number two on this list, clear out your closet. The third thing that you can do during this quarantine is restore your clothes. Have you ever owned that favorite shirt that you love so much, but after one load in the wash, you take it out and what happens? It shrinks. Or have you ever had that favorite pair of black denim where you wore all the time, but eventually it just lost its darkness? Ultimately, this is a great time for you to be able to revive those clothes and make sure that they have a lot of life left. In order to unshrink clothes, I would take a bucket of water, put conditioner in it, and just let my clothes sit up for about 20 minutes. The conditioner will allow the fabrics to stretch out and go back to its original shape. And as for darkening my pants, I would take a bucket of water, put black fabric dye in it, and let my pants soak for about 30 minutes. After taking it out, you're gonna see that your pants are a lot darker, and you're gonna be a lot more happier with your favorite pair of black denim. Just restoring your clothes and bringing life to them is just gonna allow you to wear them a lot more, and you're gonna be a lot more happier as well. So number three on this list, follow those hacks in order to restore your old clothes. Now the fourth thing that you can do during this quarantine is customizing your own clothes. Now really this is based on your own creativity. I've seen a lot of people on Facebook and Instagram take an old pair of jeans or shirt that they never wear anymore and just really add their own artwork and patterns to it and I just think it's really cool. I've even seen someone add a favorite scene of theirs from an anime to an old pair of jeans and I just think it looks pretty fire. Really, this will just bring out your own creativity and your own sense of style and will just make you look more unique. So number four on this list, use your creativity to customize some of your own clothes. The fifth thing that you can do during this quarantine is to keep an eye on those online sales. Basically during this time, a lot of stores are marking down their clothes which makes them a lot more cheaper. This is a great way to save money and basically find some steals to add to your closet. Which basically takes me on to the last and final thing on this list and that is to just save your money. During this time, I know money may come short to some people and it's just a lot harder to make. So basically my advice to you guys is to just be more mindful of how you spend your money. So you really don't need to show off at this time. You don't need to flex. Just save your money and wait for when the time is better. This is ultimately gonna prepare you for when quarantine is over as the money that you've saved is gonna come into better use. Now this doesn't just mean clothes, but it also means other resources such as food and water and other necessities. So there we have it. Those are five sneaker and style tips that you can do during quarantine. I know it probably sucks having to stay home every single day, but guys, like right now, we just wanna make sure that we make the best of our time and also make sure that we're prepared for when it's over. So if you liked the video, give it a big thumbs up. And if you want to hear more from me, smash the subscribe button because more will be on the way. 
I hope you guys are continuing to be productive at home and just keeping yourselves busy. But yeah, I'm out. Peace.